This time I've got another four numbers, and again I'm going to convert them into 16-bit sign and magnitude format. My first number is 17. So 17 in decimal is 16 plus 1 in binary, and this is a positive number. So because it's a positive number, my sign bit will be a zero. Now again, I need a number of leading zeros, and then the actual precision of my magnitude. Again, I've got a 16-bit number. It's now inside in magnitude format. Next number is negative 31. This is 1 less than 32. So I will have every bit after the 32 bit turned on. This is a negative number. And because it's a negative number, my sign bit will be a 1. Now I need a number of leading zeros to fill in the space. And then the actual magnitude of my number. And there's negative 31 in sign and magnitude format. The next number is 48. So 48 is 32 plus 16, so I will turn on both of those bits and leave all of the others off. This is a positive number, so my sign bit is a zero. Fill in a number of leading zeros, and then my actual number. So there is 48 in sign and magnitude format. The last number is negative 42. So 42 is 32 plus 10, and that's a negative number this time. As a result, my sign bit is a 1. I have a number of leading zeros, and then the actual magnitude of my number. So there is negative 42 in sign and magnitude format.